Number two, uh, you're not using the init command. You don't have documentation. You don't have a cloud.md file. This is so important because I see so many developers tell me, oh, cloud code is not learning about my preferences. Of course it's not. Of course, because you're not putting in documentation. You're not explaining to cloud code how you want it to work. So you need to have documentation. And I'll show you an example. Take a look at this. I have over here a playbook of prompt engineering because I'm working on an agent and this agent, um, I need to use the best prompt techniques that I can. So I do everything at my disposal and I have uh, a documentation that I reference in my cloud and the file. You can see that I, I reference it here. And what this does is it picks up the best uh, prompt techniques that I was able to find. And whenever I say, hey, improve this prompt, Cloud Code is going to look at this file and is going to apply all the best ideas for making high quality prompts. So that's it for your project. You should run the slash init command to uh, work in the way that you want to work. You're free to use natural language to explain and it's going to definitely improve your results a whole lot.